December 12th it's December 12th and I am getting ready to go get some tacos it's Sunday I've been cleaning doing laundry I've been putting up the Christmas stuff and now we are about to go get food I'm going to get tacos Gabby doesn't want tacos she's not feeling so great so we're gonna get her some soup but yeah I'm gonna get some tacos but yeah welcome to another weekly vlog y'all hello Hey y'all, welcome back to another vlog. It is Sunday, December. Mm. December 12th. It's December 12th and I am getting ready to go get some tacos. It's Sunday, I've been cleaning, doing laundry, I've been putting up the Christmas stuff and now we are about to go get food. I'm going to get tacos. Gabby doesn't want tacos, she's not feeling so great, so we're going to get her some soup. But yeah, I'm going to get some tacos. But yeah, welcome to another weekly vlog, y'all. Hello. Take it on all this baggage, add it on so much weight. Had me thinking that I was average, when you really don't. Alright y'all, so I just pulled up to my aunt's house. She is having a um, little party at her house today. So I'm here with my mom. I'm pretty sure I've been with my mom late because I just got here and she was already running late but she was waiting on me to get here. So now I'm here and we got to go in here. So yeah, I'm gonna see y'all in a minute. Let's see what they doing. I believe this is like a, um, a accessory jewelry party type of situation. So yeah, let's go see what they got. Okay, y'all. So, y'all see my lips? I have. <laughs> like, everybody's watching me. <laughs> I have my finished lips on by Miss Chanel. So, she has all the colors. So, if you need. A lipstick or a lip stain that can only be taken off by who? Jesus. Jesus himself. <laughs> That's the Avon lady. Or the Avon lady. This right here works really well. Yes, the Avon lady. She provides the removal wipes that take off makeup and my lipstick that is hard to get off. This is the Avon lady. Hi, I'm Myra. So I'm, I'm the local Avon lady. So you guys be sure to hit these ladies up for your makeup and skincare needs. You 
today in this blow dryer i've never done i was just told that i should blow dry him because it's cold outside so you can be told my man is scared y'all look at this come here richard y'all he should not be running like that it's a blow dryer <laughs> papa come here come to mama come here it's just my hand. Come here. <laughs> come, come. Come here. Come here. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay, Richard. Come back. That's a no-go. Anyway, y'all, I'm about to finish tackling laundry so I can chill for the rest of the night. I need to order some food, but I don't know where I want food from. Anyway, I'll see y'all later. What is up, y'all? It is been a... It has... Hey, y'all. Welcome back. It's been a couple days since I picked up the camera. Because I honestly haven't done anything worth vlogging or recording. So, yeah. But today, I'm going to get a facial by Eugene. And honestly, I'm extremely excited because I have never, as much as I'm into skincare, I have never had a facial in my life. So, this will be a new experience. So, I thought I'd take you guys with me. I'm going to see Eugene at Jeannie Grooms. I believe that's what it's called. I will link all of his information somewhere either here or here in the description box. So if you want to go see him, you can. But yeah, I'm so excited. Like, I was texting him last couple days like, I need to come see you. I need to get a facial. I've been struggling with hyperpigmentation 
and it's been whooping my ass and I'm sick of it. I'm sick of it. So I'm going to see, you know, what he suggests. I have all these serums and things that are supposed to help with the hyperpigmentation, but I just feel like I'm not seeing enough results or fast enough. So we about to go get this facial and then I also have a wax appointment to get, um, a Brazilian wax because listen I thought I was gonna be like oh a frugal girl and save money by not getting Brazilians during the winter I thought completely wrong because this hair growing thing with the razor it's not working it grows back too fast it's giving me very much I'm stressed out because why is this hair growing like this and then it's just uncomfortable like just hair down there is ugh and then like a little TMI but that hair that's between your ass it got to go I can't do it and the rates are not getting it how it need to be got so we're gonna do a little grooming today a little pampering and then I do have a client later I've done most of my clients already but I have one more this evening so I'm just gonna do a look for my little break I have like a three or four hour break so I said why not take care of me you know merry christmas to me but yeah y'all i will see y'all at the um estheticians y'all i was watching the nice and neat podcast with tank on it today and it reminded me so much of this album sex love and pain baby listen i wasn't even old enough to be feeling this album the way i did when it came out i just like good music and good vocalism but now that i'm older like this album just ain't different in its own apple music and it wasn't so i had to run it back anyway i just thought i put that out there if y'all didn't know sex love and pain is on apple music and it wasn't once before so i'm excited Baby, you don't know what you do to me Between me and you, I feel a like chemistry I won't let no one come and take your place Cause the love you give, you can't be replaced So no one else can make you do That's why I find my life with you I wanna please you in any way I can I wanna share my world, don't you understand? That I don't want you here. 
Something about the way you stare into my eyes I know that I don't make things clear I fall for you every time I try to resist Taking it away, I'm just beach fuels in an every day All I wanna hear is an every single we play Staring next to you La Baguette. I've never ate here. I've heard good things though. It's kind of cute. A little French brunch. Oh shit. Oh, see, we. Uh Most likely to cry when they're drunk. It was. It took Cameron and the 
If if Kia won it, but then the other person was Beyonce. I can see it. I can see that too. Who's most likely to get into a fight? A lot of people say me. Really? But the other people was Raven. Me? That's surprising. I'm I put Raven her. because Raven talk too loud. She be she won't fight though. She won't fight. She, she the one that be trying to pop. I was just gonna let you try. And I'm willing to pop. I ain't even gonna hit you. See, I'm gonna let you hit me first, but I'm just saying like she talks so loud that somebody ain't trying to fight her. I know it. it tastes I'm like a, liquor. Look, look, look. I'm not about to fight. I'm not about to try to fight. I'm too old. But I put Beyonce. Great. Thank you. Thank you. <sighs> Man, listen. Okay, when you put in a position, you got to do what you got to do. We was at the dollhouse that night. And we thought Raven was gonna fight that girl. No, that one time that guy tried to fight her. No, that boy did try to fight me. Yeah, purple martini. That was that purple martini. On stage. She was like, do you know who my uncle is? And I was so mad because I'm like, Wayne, you sitting right here and you're not going to do nothing. But he he mushed me in the face. Yeah, he did. I don't know if he was trying to talk to somebody. No, I think he was trying to talk to like Desi or something, and Raven was there, and then he got mad. She's like, "You dusty or something." No, it was because he got disrespectful. Yeah, I don't know. Because I don't just fuck with niggas like that. But he wasn't really for you though. He was for her. But I think you kind of dismissed him, like he needed to move, like move around. He got mad, and then he tried to get in her face, and then she put her foot up and kicked. Did she not come wish me? I don't give a fuck if you is a nigga. Hey, who's gonna jump his ass that good night? Kid was like, a kid could say, what? <laughs> can, I <laughs> <go> <laughs> <laughs> can I get my room clean? Because I'm ready. Like, come on, y'all, we got to do a little ring. Jump on All right, you can have it right now. You're going to have it. Thank you. There's a young titty nipple out. Oh, it's like, out. Yeah. Oh, you're going to put the drink in. Oh, wow. Give me this, too. They're not even the same color. Is that okay? Yeah, that's a. a they never the same. Oh. This looks like a line. It's supposed to be a circle. It's supposed so to be more down. of a circle. You go up. You go up. You go. Like staggered. There we go. It's starting to look better. Staggered and circle. Daisy, you go up. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Sharice, come up a little bit. Oh, yeah. Get your orange on first. Love the kids. <laughs> Love the kids. Love the uh-oh. We didn't do nothing. Yeah, I was saying we didn't do nothing. <laughs> 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 Wait, okay. She might be in something already. I ain't high right now, but damn, I feel like it. Well, well, I, I got the shop today. Okay, me too. I didn't get my grades up. Okay. One, two. Everybody come out a little bit. Okay, can we get some little... Uh, yeah, come in. Yeah, do y'all see come in? Okay, come out. I want to down this so I can get another one. Next question. Mm -hmm. So, okay, so Kia won, and then Raven, Dizzy, and Beyonce all had equal. I mean, equal. Who's the most toxic? Raven. Yes, Raven won that one, but Dizzy was a close second. But I would have picked Dizzy over Raven. I didn't. I think I picked myself actually. I would have picked Dizzy over Raven any day because. Just because of her last incident with her baby daddy. And how yeah, she said exactly. she can't date, but she can't yeah. date. That was that. She be tripping. Um, all right. I got it from my mama. Hi, Next one. Oh, and Cameron was another. Cameron Cameron? But Cameron chose himself, I'm sure. Yeah. Oh. Um, who's most likely to go missing on a night out? Yeah, you know. That wasn't me. I did win that one, but Raven was the second. Oh, no, no, no. Raven wasn't. Well, Raven and Cameron were tied, but I think Cameron chose himself again. Um, and I just want to say, I be in the same spot. Right. Who is freak nasty? Raven. That was a unanimous answer. That's crazy. Um, <laughs> who's most likely to die in a zombie apocalypse? And I want to talk to you about that because I know you chose me. Because <laughs> you're listening. See, what I tell you, I told them this last no, night. Because she came at me thinking it was me. I thought it was her. And I was like, because I texted her after the first thing came through. And I was like, you... No, the person that's gonna die is you. Desi don't like to listen, but she do. I tell Desi what's gonna happen, and she tell me, no. just wait and no. let me know when it's that's time what to I run. Said. Okay, said, hey, but the thing is, so Raven, the thing is, Raven be tripping, right? Weird. And she yeah, be like, I cannot feed like, like, everybody. They mess with my head. I'm not gonna do it. I'm at the, I'm at the, so who won? I said Deontay. No, Raven. But y'all, I don't know. Y'all think, think it's Sharice and too. Deontay was the winner. Yeah. Everybody, you had 57. Girl, you won a lot of these. Uh, uh, I don't be prepared. Cameron is the only one. Closely second was Sharice. 
Jackie? I didn't choose you. Me neither. I didn't choose you. I, I chose Beyonce. Y'all said I was die in the box. You, you had two Raven. Raven chose me. Oh. So it was Beyonce and maybe Cameron. Cameron, yeah. Not See, this the, the grab. He was 28. Oh, okay. Ain't gonna choose me over you. Um, okay, so who gives the best advice? Um, I did win that one, but Cameron, Kia, Desi, Beyonce. It's 14%. So everybody picked one Uh, Who takes the longest to get ready? Raven. And I know you chose me. I know you chose me. I chose y'all to think I get two of y'all. That's why I said pick multiple or something. And I I was here before Raven today, so I'm not even. You have your days where be like, But it's not my fault. I was ready to go. Deontay, I had to wait for my ride. And Deontay had a toddler to take care of this morning. Oh, oh, like, you was, and you was texting everybody like you was ready. And up right, that's up. why I was surprised you weren't here before I got here. And I got here first. She had her nephew. Cordillo. You should have brought him to you. She was going to. Um, who got the most hoes? Pearls for the girls. Hmm. Oh, okay. From my big sister. Little sister Linda. No way. Hey, Journey. No way. No way. Say hello. Can I make a video? Say yeah. Say something. Welcome to my channel. Hey.